Hey, good morning, everyone. Welcome to Everyday Faith, day 14. Uh, first and foremost, thank you all so much for uh, welcoming me back with open arms over the last 24 hours. Uh, appreciate you guys, your kindness and your and your love and just your the words that you've uh, you've shared with me. It's been it's been uh, nice to see. So thank you all um, for welcoming me back. Um, so we're on day 14 today. It's an action, um, and it says this. One of the best ways to see God's renewal in your life is to examine who you once were next to who you're becoming. List below what God has renewed in your life. Example, from selfish to generous, from angry to joyful, from negative to positive. You know, what are those things uh, for you? And, uh, and also maybe some that you're, you're, you're longing for, right? Maybe you're not there yet, but things that maybe you're longing uh, to change, right? And, um, and a lot of these things, I think, are, can only be changed through Christ. Um, you know, there's, there's the moment you accept Christ in your heart, there's an automatic change. People see something different about you. They may not know what it is, but they, they feel it. They want to be around you. Um, there's a light that shines. And, um, and so, you know, take, that, take action today and really um, kind of meditate and think about these things. What are the things that you went from to have come to um, since you have become a Christian and really renewed your life with him. So again, one of the best ways to see God's renewal in your life is to examine who you once were and who you're becoming. There's going to be a list there that you can write to and from, or from and to, I guess would be a better way to look at it. Uh, but let's do that today. Let's take action on this um, and let's celebrate you know, what we become and who we become um, through our relationship with Jesus. Guys, be blessed. Have a great day, and we'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.